I want to show you how you can generate bank transactions from your bank feed in Business Central. First of all, we're going to look at bank reconciliation, and then we're going to generate the GL transactions. Here's my bank account reconciliation screen for my checking account. On the left hand side, I've got all the transactions from the bank that were loaded in through a bank feed. I've got these three transactions at the bottom for which I have no corresponding transactions in BC. So let's take a look at how we do that. First of all, I've got two bank transfers. I got a bank transfer into this, this account and a bank transfer out. That means the other side of that amount is going to another bank account in Business Central. Then I've got a bank fees amount here. This is being taken out of my account. It needs to be charged to my general ledger. So let's take a look at how we do that. So the first thing I want to do is I'm going to select these three transactions. I'm going to go up to process and transfer it to the general ledger. I'm just going to use a general journal entry. I'll generate that. But you can see that I'm not complete here, right? I've got the dollar amounts over here on the right hand side. And they're coming out of this checking account here, We're going into it. So what I need to do is balance the other side of the transaction. First of all, these first two are bank transfers. So I want these going to my bank account. So I just select a bank account here. These are going to go into my savings. And then this one is a bank fee. I need to charge it to a GL account. Charge it to this one here. So this is my entire general journal transaction. I've got it coming out or going into this checking account here. The bank transfers are going to or from the savings account. And the bank charges are being charged to this general ledger account. So then I just go ahead and post this. So let's take a look at the bank reconciliation now. These three transactions at the bottom have now been matched with transactions that we just created in Business Central. You can see those right here. They're all applied and balanced. Let's take a look at the transactions in these two bank accounts. So here's the checking account. Let's look at the trial balance. Just run the whole thing. And here are the three transactions from the checking account. We've got the two bank transfers and then the bank fees. Let's take a look at the savings account. Here are the two transactions that are bank transfers between one account and another. And that's how you can generate bank transactions from your bank feed in Dynamics 365 Business Central.